Hey everyone, Technomancer here with the video for you guys. Now, if the Bluetooth on your iPhone 16 Pro or any of the newer iPhone is not recognizing other devices on iOS 18, you want to follow these steps to fix it. So let's get started. The very first thing you want to travel shoot is putting your pulling down a control menu and putting your phone on airplane mode briefly for about 10-15 seconds or so and turn that off. And that does a quick network refresh and see if that all is connected. Now, if that didn't work, moving on to the next thing you want to do is go into your setting on your iPhone, click on Bluetooth, turn off Bluetooth momentarily, and then you also want to turn it off on the other device that's not recognizing it, and then turn on Bluetooth on both of the devices and see if you can, if they recognize each other and can connect. Now, if that's not happening, let's say you connected to the device in the past, it's going to be listed under My Devices. You're going to click on that information icon right here, that I with the circle. You're going to click on forget this device, click on forget. And once you forget it, again, try to reconnect again because the device will reappear and then you'll be able to go ahead and try the reconnection again. Now, if that's not working for you, the next thing you want to do is change the name of your phone's Bluetooth name. So in your settings, go to general, about, and now it says name right here. It's going to say a generic thing, maybe iPhone, or if you named it in the past, whatever the name is, try changing it temporarily to something else. So uh, I put uh, iPhone, something else like 16 Pro or, or something like it doesn't matter. It could be anything as long as you change it and then you're going to hit done here. And as you can see here, the name has been changed. You're going to go back to the settings into your Bluetooth, turn off Bluetooth, turn it back on and forget the device if you reconnect it and then try to reconnect again same thing on the other device that you have you want to forget it as well if there's an option again depending on what kind of device you have uh, just look up the way to reset the bluetooth on it and then do this again now if this isn't helping the next thing to, to do is go into your settings go to general go all the way down where it says transfer reset iphone tap on that and then click on reset and you're going to do a reset of the network which basically will reset things like saved Wi-Fi and Bluetooth connected devices to factory default. This will not delete any of your data, but it's again crucial to do this if you're still having issues with the Bluetooth connectivity with other devices. Now, after you have done that and it's still not working, the next thing to do is follow these steps. You're gonna quickly press and release the volume up, quickly press and release the volume down, and then hold on to the side button until the screen goes completely black and the Apple logo reappears. So I'll do quickly volume up volume down one after another and then I hold on to the side button and do not touch the screen during the whole process just keep on holding that side button just like I am here as you can see here I'm holding on that side button and waiting for it to go completely black and once I see the Apple logo reappear I let go of it this is known as a force restart which basically shuts down the phone software reloads the code so any software related issue causing Bluetooth to not work correctly, we'll go ahead and fix this problem. And once you're back on, we're gonna go ahead and do one more troubleshooting steps, which will fix it. So let's go ahead and get into our phone again. The final thing to do is go into your settings, go to general, software update, and check if there's an update out. And the reason why it is maybe a previous update that you did caused some issues, and Apple usually will fix a release or a bug fix for a release which will come up here as you can see here there's an update right now at the time of recording which again fixes important bug fixes and recommended for user because i think you're just going to go ahead and update your phone to make sure your phone again doesn't have any bug or software glitches that could be causing bluetooth not to work so go ahead and do that and after doing this i hope your iphone is working it's able to connect to the bluetooth if so please consider a like and subscribe button for more tips and tricks for your iphone and other ios devices we'll see you guys next time